Prop F, rightly or wrongly, I think is perceived by uh, folks as an indictment of the management of our water system over the last 20 to 25 years. And I think that's unfortunate, um, but we, we are far behind the rest of the state and the rest of the country when it comes to sustainable water practices. And you know, Susan talks and, and, and the opponents talk about how great we are at conserving water, but you know, folks, we don't have front yards, swimming pools, or uh, air conditioning, so we can't use water. And I've been a renter in my apartment in Hayes Valley for 14 years, and I've never seen a water bill. More importantly, the SFPUC has never sent me something encouraging me to um, uh, conserve water. 65, 68% of San Franciscans rent their homes, and so the vast majority of us don't pay our water bills, which is the single best impetus for conserving water. So um, I think the reason, uh, there are two reasons. One is that this is a bit of indictment of the existing leadership, and I don't think that's the case. We're constantly trying to change and improve the way we're doing business. Um, and, um, you know, Senator Feinstein has long-standing opposition to this, and honestly, she casts a very dark shadow over, over people get late-night phone calls from the good senator threatening them. So um, I think oh, that has, I know, it's no, unfortunate, no. but it's true. Susan Liao. Let's talk about outreach to the customers. At least when I was general manager, I know the, uh, my successor in general, as general manager of the SFPUC did aggressive outreach to those people who pay the bill. And what happens is with, with a lot of, we do have tenant kits that we give out to property owners, but we do reach out, and, they, and, the, and the utility does reach out to property owners so that they provide incentives for low flow fixtures, low flow toilets, and that has been a real hallmark. And yes, oh, we don't have swimming pools and we don't have lawns, but you know what? During the day, our place balloons to twice its size. And that's a lot of water being used by people. And yet, we're able to conserve by reaching out the utility, has reached out to the, to the restaurants, the hotels, and to aggressively, in a, in, a, in a nice way, to the residents basically saying, he, he, use less water, we'll provide you incentive to use less, and if you use more, you'll pay a higher tier rate. And if you've seen any of Can your I water agree? bills, if you've seen any of your water bills, and I'm sorry as a renter you haven't, but that, that's probably a good thing if you, you probably don't want to see your water bill, but if you've seen your water bills, they're tiered rates, and as you start using more, you get a higher bill. That's why we reach out to the property owners. That's why the PUC did when I was general manager, and I know that uh, the current GM uh, is doing that as well. Uh, can I agree Mike with Marshall? Susan for a sec? Is, is that Do she, you have to? Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, and, and she's right in projecting that, in fact, the SFPUC is projecting that we as um, residents will reduce our water consumption by 10 million gallons a day. Um, we currently use about 80, and it's going to go down to about 70, which is extraordinary and terrific. But the SFPUC, what do they want to do with that water? Do they want to leave it in the natural environment? Do they want to leave it on the Tuolumne River? No, they want to sell it at cost to Silicon Valley because they are projecting more water needs into the future. So the incentive for us to conserve is completely eliminated relative to our environmental sensibilities. This, the Prop F is not just designed about coming up with a plan, but it's in fact ultimately designed to change the way we as a city think about water. We, can't, we have to have a 21st century notion of water, which is to leave as much of it in the natural environment compared to the 20th century when the, the philosophy was, let's take as much of it out of the environment and, and hoard it as much as we can. Um, we need to leave as much in the natural environment and reuse and reuse the water we have far more effectively than we are on the tra tra trajectory to do.